The political climate created by the global war on terror after the 9-11 attacks set the stage for large increases in the Pentagon budget, much of which went to military contractors. A new article by Brown University's Cost of War Project has shed light on military spending by the Pentagon after 9-11. The Pentagon budget increased by over 10% in the first year after the 9-11 attacks and the commencement of the war in Afghanistan. The Pentagon budget untimely increased year after year for 10 years running and peaked in 2010 at the highest level since World War II. The uh, President Eisenhower, when he was leaving office, talked about the military industrial complex and these are the people that supply the weapons for wars and in order to have a war you have to have some, some type of threat and that's was provided by 9-11 and they decided to cash in on that this provided uh, unique opportunities for stealing money the study says over 14 trillion dollars was spent by the pentagon since the start of the war in afghanistan the report says $4.4 trillion of the total spending went towards weapons procurement and research and development. That category directly benefited corporate military contractors. Out of the $4.4 trillion, the top five U.S. weapons makers, Lockheed, Martin, Boeing, General Dynamics, Raytheon, and Northrop Grumman received $2.2 trillion, almost half. Besides getting paid for weapons and research, U.S. corporations profit from private contractors that are deployed to war zones. The most notorious private security contractor previously employed by the Pentagon is Blackwater. It is a mercenary group whose employees massacred 17 people in Iraq's Nasr Square back in 2007. The Pentagon also employed private contractors for just about every task in U.S. war zones. At the end of the Trump administration, only 2,500 U.S. troops were left in Afghanistan, but over 18,000 Pentagon contractors were still in the country. And uh, what we saw recently was that they were, a lot of those weapons that got left behind were delivered within uh, weeks of the end of the war. I mean, very close to uh, pulling out, which meant that they had to unload them uh, in order to, to cash in on what they were doing, they, they also uh, unloaded them into a group of people who could use them uh, to destabilize the region, which was also their intent. The report explained how China is the new justification for military spending. As the U.S. has reduced the size of its military footprint in Iraq and Afghanistan, exaggerated estimates of the military challenges allegedly posed by China have become the new rationale of choice in arguments for keeping the Pentagon budget at historically high levels. The most likely impact of the shift towards China will be to further tighten the grip of major weapons makers like Northrop Grumman, Lockheed Martin, General Dynamics, and Raytheon Technologies on the Pentagon budget. Over the past few years, the U.S. has adopted a confrontational approach toward China. There are many contentious issues the two countries have been quarreling over. China is much more complicated because both countries, China and the United States, are tied together economically in a way that would be very difficult to disentangle over, uh, in short notice. The uh, uh, United States is dependent on uh, China for a large bulk of its manufacturers, including crucial manufacturers like computer chips. The U.S. accuses China of genocide against the Uyghur population in the province of Xinjiang. China has rejected the accusations, asking the U.S. to stop interfering in what Beijing considers its internal affairs. The two countries have also been locked in a trade dispute since 2018, when the Trump administration imposed tariffs on more than 360 billion US dollars of Chinese goods, and China retaliated with tariffs on more than 110 billion dollars of US products. US meddling in the South China Sea and provocative speeches by US officials have also angered China with Beijing accusing Washington of being the direct driver of tensions in the region.